So once you've got that basic sliding note down, um, we're gonna get into some little bit more advanced stuff. I mean, if you've blown other kinds of elk calls, it'll be really innate to you as to what you wanna say. And if you're new to elk calling, I'd suggest going on YouTube and finding some videos of some real elk, some real cows chirping or something, so that when you're practicing your call, you know what to sound like. Um, but what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna put the call in my mouth and I'm gonna put my teeth on it just past the o-ring and that'll give you a little bit more control of your playability and especially control of, of your volume and you know when you link your breathing to your jaw it's more innate than playing it with your fingers which you can but I prefer to use my teeth so and that leaves my hands free um, you can shoot your bow obvious advantage but you can also use your hands to kind of um, contort the sound so it's probably my favorite thing to do is to hold my right hand in front of the call put a cup in it like that and then put my left hand cupped in with the with the right hand but leaving it so the sound will flow out this way you can do it the other way to kind of throw the the project your call you know if you want to pretend like the elk are over here or over there you can kind of throw it like that but generally when I play a, any kind of cow vocalizations or especially bugling with this I'm going to use some kind of form to alter the sound. So that means putting in your mouth and, and you leave your hands free. So the first thing that I'll probably teach you guys how to play is, is a calf vocalization. It's going to be a really high pitched note. Um, and so you're going to play that by squeezing the call and blowing it and just barely releasing it and playing a kind of a, a higher pitch. So, I mean, and that's pretty simple. That's, that's basically, one of the most common elk vocalizations is that calf vocalization. So you're just squeezing the call and just using a shorter note and not letting it open up as much as when you play that basic note that I first taught you. So try that, playing that. Just varying the pressure with your teeth and, and the air pressure from your lungs. So.